Bible High School. School. Our school is located in North Berwick, Maine. The students come from three nearby towns, Berwick, North Berwick, and Lebanon. This is the Salmon Falls River. It is where our water comes from. In 2016, lots of manganese suddenly appeared in public drinking water in Berwick. There had been a severe drought in southern Maine, and this river was almost stagnant. Due to decreased water flow, the manganese from the rocks and soil of the riverbed contaminated the public water supply. As community members, we feel that we can use our STEM knowledge and skills to help solve the problem. We brainstormed our technique. Our solution was to use sulfate solution to filter manganese out of the water. This would cause the pH level to drop and become more acidic. Our idea was approved by the director of the Berwick Water Department. We learned that the plant had already been using aluminum sulfate to filter out part of the manganese, the tiny solid particles, and raising the pH afterwards using sodium hydroxide. However, the dissolved manganese was still not significantly removed. We modified our plan to remove the leftover manganese more efficiently. We did more research on the issue by using our STEM knowledge of chemistry, computer science, and math, and we looked up guidance for the treatment of magnemies. We went to the Summersworth Water Department to learn their strategy, taking into consideration the current operation system of the water treatment plant and the chemicals that were available and approved by the Maine Department of Health and Human Services. Our modified method was to add sodium carbonate to increase the pH before the sulfate solution dropped the pH, which would turn the dissolved manganese into solid particles that could be filtered out after the addition of the sulfate solution. We conducted five tests. During the process, we applied STEM methods of observation, testing, and retheorizing. The laboratory testing proved that this modified technique could work in the full-scale plant. We also created a spreadsheet. It calculated the formula automatically. The director said the spreadsheet we created was useful. Then we built a prototype to further test our method. The prototype is a simulator of the water plant in a smaller scale. The filter takes the water that is already filtered but still has some manganese in it and runs it through a special filter media that is designed to remove manganese. It is called a post contactor. It will be an extra step after the filter. We ran the test through the prototype and the result seemed promising. We had to wait a day or two for the result to come out. The director told us that the result was satisfactory. He would run the test a couple more times as the results would take days to come out. If the results were consistent, which he thought they would be, he would implement our technique into the full-scale plant. The prototype has proved to be useful and efficient. It can test any techniques on a smaller scale before it can be fully implemented into the water system. The director said that his staff would continue to use it to do tests. Good job.